I have this thing. Uh, one of my blocks that I told you is is yelling. I hate it when people yell at me. Mm-hmm. I can't. I, I like. I have people in my life who have yelled at me, and like I just don't like talk to them anymore. <laughs> just like I just like I can't go there. I can't. I can be honest. Anyone can be, I feel like anyone can, who knows me well knows they can be honest with me. Mm-hmm. Even you and I talk on the phone sometimes, like, you'll tell me things that are just, like, critical but true. And Yeah. And I, I mean, I, I the famous one is after your show, I said, like, not as good as the, not as good as the last one, better than the one before that. Yeah. yeah, it's yeah, like, yeah. Like, yeah. Literally I don't right even know if that's it. true, but it's my opinion. That was your take. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, like, um, yeah, no, so I can take, like, frankness. Um, yelling somehow like shuts me down and so like to like to circle back to like what do I feel when I lose control it's like anger and it's like a thing where I and I think that my dad expressed it when I was growing up through yelling which some people say this is healthy some people say yelling is healthy I don't know maybe it is but I don't do it and then I end up feeling like anxiety from it from other people yelling or from you yelling from other people yelling or me me feeling like I'm out of control and then feeling like like anger from it how do you deal with like having to change things M- meaning if you're directing something or your show or yeah. you're like hey I need it a certain way I've gotten I think over the years like I've just worked on um the language of um I really would love for this to be like this. Um, can we try to figure out how that might be like that? And I, so yeah, it's hard to get there. Yeah. I, cause the instinct is this. Yeah. And it's like, how do you get the, the instinct, instinct? is Why is a, that right there? The but instinct at, is a flinch. Yeah. It's, it's like a hot stove. Right. Right. So it's like, it, to me, I, it feels like, uh, a hot stove if somebody's not doing the thing I need the thing that we talked about right the thing that we agreed to and right. they're not doing it feels like a hot stove and you're getting to the point where you're going like you know what stove would you mind taking yourself down a few degrees funny. and I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna take my hand away stove <laughs> and I just hope that you understand, Stove, <laughs> that this is in no way a judgment on you. Like I can't, I may never uh, get there. I'm get, I've gotten better. Wow, I've gotten better. I I was directing a commercial like a couple days after an ayahuasca thing, and and I was like, and they just weren't doing. It. I go, you know what? Maybe we're not supposed to get this shot, right? And, and by the way, then I got it. But I my I did get a moment of like, you know what? Maybe guys, I, I maybe maybe what I'm asking for isn't realistic, but I'm the part of me. There's still always going to be a part of me that I think it's, and I've talked about it on here before, because me and Dave didn't get half baked the way we wanted, paid a price. Yes, and then so now I'm like, am I going to pay that price again? Yeah, am I going to be in the woods for five years? Yeah, again because. Uh, for a myriad of reasons but wow hey did you like that did you like that yeah did you like it though you want more don't want to work would rather watch videos of me grab assing with people first of all go up here to subscribe and then go up here to uh watch more clips this is like when the weatherman says there's a high pressure system coming in i'm not really used to the green screen